I love it. It's so good. Hi guys, so I am at Novina Velocity and today I'll be introducing to you a Thai restaurant. So if you don't know, uh, I love Thai food. And like many other Singaporeans, I will make a yearly visit to Thailand for my cheap shopping, massage and Thai food fix. But unfortunately, due to COVID, we are unable to travel. So here I am today for my Thai food fix. So this restaurant is conveniently located near Novena MRT and I like how it's very very centrally accessible yet it's not crowded like all the other restaurants in town like Orchard or Somerset on a weekend. Okay, so for the first dish, we have the lemongrass salad. It's not a very commonly seen dish in Thai restaurants in Singapore, but it's my must order every time I'm here. It's basically lemongrass with shredded coconuts, dried shrimps, and cashews. And you can make it into a wrap with the lettuce provided. It's like an explosion of flavours in my mouth. I really like the crunch from the dried shrimps and the lemongrass makes everything so fragrant. As well as the cashews, you know, you have a slight nuttiness. It's very, very nice and it's such a good appetizer. Every time I have this, I always feel like I need to introduce this to more people because not many people know of this dish and it's so good. Like, you have to definitely order this when you are here. So here we have the seafood ota in coconut and it looks so good Like wow, look at the amount of seafood there is Oh my god, look at that Spilled to the brim mm. So this ota in a coconut has a pretty strong coconut milk taste and it's a lot creamier than the usual barbecue ota that we get um, I really like it because and the coconut milk adds, adds a little bit of fragrance. There is like prawns, squid, fish, is that fish? Ota, and real coconut. I like how the ota isn't like overpowered by its spiciness. It's actually not that spicy, um, but it's very, very flavorful. So I've been to this restaurant multiple times, but it's actually my first time ordering this dish. So this is the prawns in yellow curry powder, and I'm really excited to try it out. Wow, the prawns are huge. They look so fresh. This is not like normal curry, it's like eggs were bitten into the curry so it's a bit more like on the eggy thick side and it's a bit salty yet the saltiness from the curry actually complements the sweetness of the prawns really really well and it's great when you have it with rice a very nice side dish. So my drink is here and I ordered for myself the coconut milkshake. So you know when you visit Thai restaurants, there are always the typical few drinks that you order like Thai milk tea, lemongrass, coconut and this is my must order whenever I visit this restaurant. Basically the taste wise, it's quite similar to Mr. Coconut's coconut shake uh, but it's slightly more milky and um, it's not too sweet and that's a very very strong coconut flavour. I think they use real coconut for this. I like it and I think it's a great thirst quencher when you're having such spicy Thai food. Mm. Wow, I can't believe we finished everything. I'm so full. Well, if you really like Thai food, I would recommend that you check out this place. And on a scale of 1 to 10, from a must visit, go if you're nearby, or try once can already, I rate this a uh, must visit for their lemongrass salad and seafood ota and coconut. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye!